in the in this video we would like to see how to create a customized image classification model using OCI vision services first identifying the data set then uploading the image files into the OCI bucket and the creation of JSON and JSONL files which will enable OCI to process these images and create custom model and finally creation of the model itself we will examine an example data set of wheat harvesting pigs these pigs show you either that are too early to harvest or nearing harvest or that are ready for the harvest. Apart from the images, we also require two additional files, information JSON and records JSON L file. Let us open information JSON file. This file uh, is required by OCI. This file mainly contains the bucket information where the pictures are uploaded and additional information pertaining to the data set. Let us look at the records.json file, json-l file. This contains pictures information where they are stored and the labels for that particular image. With these files, let us now log in into the OCI and then create a bucket and upload these files. OCI buckets are available in storage and object storage and archive where the buckets are present. For this purpose, we have already created a bucket called OAC Wheat Picks. However, you can also create a new bucket on your own. Uh, I am not going to create a new bucket in this case. Let us use OAC Wheat Picks bucket, which is already created. In OAC Wheat Picks, you can see the, all the pictures, images or, uh, that I have shown you earlier are already uploaded. Info and records files are also uploaded in the same folder. Let us now create a model uh, by accessing analytics and AI and the AI services under which there is a vision. Once you access the vision, you can see on the left hand side image classification. To create a custom model, you have to first create a project. Uh, you can create the project, which is a fairly straightforward process. In this case, we are going to use an existing project, custom project one. Once you go into the project, you can start creating a model. For model, you can choose an existing data set or create a new data set. We, we are going to use an existing data set, which is stored, which is put in the object storage. Let us access the right bucket where we have uploaded these pictures and select the info JSON file. Once we have selected, we can give the model name, model description, and the training duration. Please note that the longer you're going to train, the more accurate is going to be the model. Let's plus next and create and train. The model is going to take some time to train. So once the model is trained, you can actually start seeing the information about the model. The model related information such as precision, recall, F1 square, the total images, test images, and the total train duration is available. You can also see the metrics at each label level. We can use this model and access it in the OAC for further analysis. Thank you for watching the video.